Good morning, MPA artists. This is our last Follow the Leader drawing of the school year. Summer is coming up and I was thinking beaches and that you might like doing a sandcastle. So this is what we're gonna do today. Um, we're gonna start, I'm gonna, this is just uh, regular copy paper. If you have watercolor paper, that is all the better, but it's not necessary. Um, so just some crepas, watercolor paints, if possible. You can get them at CVS, Walgreens, or else you can go all out and get the liquid watercolors just as a different option. So we're gonna start this drawing. Um, I don't know, hopefully you can see both of these. So we're gonna start with a, um, Here's our paper, it's turned sideways. We're gonna start with a wavy line right along the bottom of the um, paper and that's for the sand. And then we're gonna make a short horizontal line which goes this way. Um, so there's your short line. Uh, then we're gonna connect, um, we're gonna connect this with a vertical line down to the sand. So that's the bottom of the castle. Now we're going to add two vertical lines with, which go straight up and down for the sides here. And then we're going to add castle lines. So castle lines just go um, up, over, down, over. Some of you are real familiar with these. Others, it can be a little challenging. So over, down, over, up, over, down, over, up, over, down. Okay, then we're gonna do the same here on the sides. Um, to the length of side part of the castle. Then we're just gonna add the edges of the castle here. Um, then we're gonna make three upside down U's. So this middle one here would probably be the biggest. And then the two side, these are, these are doors to your castle, okay? Um, just to give your doors a little depth, so it looks like you're kind of walking into the door, we're gonna start up here and go along the edge like this and fill it in. And it's just sort of fun because it looks like you're really walking inside. Then we're gonna add three sticks on the top and these sticks are gonna be the flags for your castle. You can make a straight triangle or you can make it look like the wind is blowing and just give it a little bit of a wave. Some of you might like, you know, doing that. Okay, um, we're gonna add a horizon line in the background, uh, right around the middle. So we're gonna go here and here. So the horizon line separating the sky from the water. A uh, couple clouds, which you won't have any trouble with. Um, add your sun. If you wanna add any beach, um, I'll just have you look at this now. If you want to add any beach toys, if you want to add a towel, blanket, yourself, I'd encourage you to um, make the sand, well, you've got kind of two distinct colors here of shades of brown. I mixed a little yellow in it. As far as the sky, you can add um, crepas to your flags, your sun, any of your fish. One thing I want you to try and do is to make your sky a slightly different color than the water. I just add a little green to the blue to make a turquoise, and then you can sort of see the separation from the sky and the water. And I think that's it. Have fun.